Ladies and gentlemen, YouTube, everybody out there, it's Phil 20. You know the deal. I'm here. I'm doing some stuff. This is at my house. I picked up a G0602 lathe. I'm trying to make some project stuff. Uh, I made this thing here. It's got pretty good compression. I, I'm. It goes further than that, but I just can't push it in. Uh, it feels like it's getting almost totally done for the fire piston stuff. I'm going to make some of those. I can, uh, heal me. I learned something too. Uh, you, whenever you open these up, it has to be on zero or close them. Ugh. I can't open it with one hand. Just a sec. Sorry about that. So, uh, this is what it looks like. It says, Model 1, right there. And what I'll need to do is make a jig to where this, like, slides into a metal bar. And then there'll be, like, a keyway all the way through it. And then I can just uh, stamp them in uh, perfect order but this thing feels uh, pretty good there's but there is oil on there if i don't put oil in there it's, it's really not good uh, it fits pretty well but the the it, that is actually feeling kind of perfect so i want to show you the the tool i made it's uh right here all right, so this is the tool I made. All right, now uh, let's get an overhead view. This is a uh, tire plug tool. I'm cutting out Scotch Brite into strips about this big, and then I'm running it in and running it out, running it in, running it out. I know that you guys are interested, probably, in all types of weird stuff I do. I have not been posting a whole lot on YouTube, and I'm sorry, but I'm learning new projects, and I just enjoy new projects. This lathe uh, is real fun. It uh, moves forward. You see it's getting closer. It's a power feed to just for one axis. Uh, I have to slowly move this one in and out, which is okay, I suppose. Um... You can thread on this, you can do all kinds of stuff, but I wanted to make some of these uh, fire pistons. This isn't totally done. You can see there's some scoring on the inside shaft. Uh, this one is for my son, and if you guys want something like that, we can figure something out, but uh, I can stamp you know, anybody's label on there if you wanted. So model one but like I said I need a jig to uh, label it I'm gonna make one it's pretty fun uh, I got a monkey light here's my monkey light I like kung fu if anybody didn't know uh, so I hope you guys like this uh, setup. It's kind of fun. There's some stuff on here that I'm going to be making. And it's not that big a deal. I still got my press over there with the pneumatic uh, compression. And it, there's just a lot of fun stuff. I mean, I just, I think it was a lot of fun to make this jig. You know, because I had to put this in backwards and then uh, turn it down the other side was had flaps on it so it would stay in the screwdriver or whatnot so I turned that down and then I made myself a jig right out of a, the tool but uh, this is a quick change tool I bought too I'll uh, I might review it I, don't, I might not but uh, it, the whole machine's pretty fun and there'll be lots more stuff, so peace out. Yeah, I got hair now. Uh, 
See you next time.